we have to govern by the realities on the ground. There is no way I can just print money and come and give to the people. No. There is only one or two ways that you can get money in order to execute government programs or to run the government. One is the statutory allocation, which comes from the Federation account, and I've given you an analysis of that. Second is the internally generated revenue. Gombe, as I said, doesn't generate up to 300 million per month, and we are 3.2 million people. So if we cannot generate that money and we cannot get it from Abuja, then why else? Because the people that money? listening to you now would ask the question, how come Gombe cannot generate more than 300 million a month? Bad governance and poor practices that refuse to allow us to, one, tax the people correctly, two, apply the little resources correctly. Because for me, any little money you have, if you indulge in expenditure that doesn't impact on the people and you don't go for, you know, mundane things that are really doesn't, uh, they are not helping the people, it means somewhere, someplace, you have to now source money to fund social welfare and to fund all the things that people will need in order to have the feeling and presence of government. So the previous government, particularly the last governor, did not care about that. His concern was not more of on the human capital, but on flimsy white elephant projects that are not really touching the people.